Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe. minutes ago for sexually abusing a six-year-old girl for over a year. Investigators say it's not the first time Brian Alexander Washington has been accused of something like this. We want to warn you, the following story contains very graphic details. Catch you 11, the only crew in court today. Anieli Ruiz joins us live outside the Harris County Courthouse where that guilty verdict just came down. Anieli. Guys, a very difficult case to cover indeed. Now, we did learn that Washington did uh, did actually, I'm so sorry, he actually has served time before for sexually rape, abusing a 13-year-old girl back in 2006. Now, take a look. This is 39-year-old Brian Alexander Washington in court today during closing arguments on trial for continuous sexual abuse of a child. The victim was only six and seven years old and was an extended family member. According to attorneys, the indictment started in August of 2015 and went on for over a year. The victim, who's now 14, testified in court yesterday. In addition to saying she was sexually assaulted, she says Washington also showed her pornography. But again, this is not the first time he's accused of doing something like this. Back in 2007, he pled guilty to aggravated sexual assault of a child when he forcibly raped a 13-year-old girl. Now, Washington served time in prison for that. Prosecutors say he also testified that back in 2005, he had sex with a 12-year-old girl and impregnated her. But there wasn't an indictment in that case, and it didn't move forward. Now, the defense attorney has elected that the judge do the punishment phase, and that's actually what's taking place right now inside the courtroom. Now, if he, um, now the judge says that he could face anywhere from 25 years to life in prison. And of course, we'll update you guys with the very latest. We'll send it back to you in the studio. A very difficult case. Annie Ellie, thank you. Thanks for watching. We appreciate you. Please, please subscribe.